Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the React. So this is an extension of the video of the React Virtualize. So here we are using the React window infinite loader. Okay, with the React window. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. So here we are using the infinite scrolling virtualized list with the React window and the React window infinite loader. What it will do, this library is an extension of the React window and allows for infinite scrolling. It's useful when you want to load more data as a user scroll. Let's take an example. So here we have the, you can see, let me reload this one. So here you can see, okay. So currently the item seven is loaded. Okay. So when, when I try to scroll down, you can see that loading, loading, then loading. So it loads the data and implement that into the DOM. Okay. You can see, okay. So only that, that elements are inserted into the DOM with the loading part. Okay. So the rest of the process is the same. So let's have a look on the code level. Okay. So just the one thing that is added that when you scroll down, only loading part is added. Okay. So let's see the code. So here we have the code react use state react fixed list size react window and infinite loader from the react window infinite loader okay then we have to define the page size the number of items to load per page then we have a function that is infinite scroll list so items we have this is the initialization of the state okay then we have a fetch page data so if loading or has more then return else set loading to be true simulate loading more data with one second delay so here we have make the array from the length page size and the index okay so this is creation of the data we here we are setting the data set items previous items with new data and set loaded items whenever we just scroll down so previous loaded items then new data just this is the you can see about the we are manipulating the items okay so when you scroll down so the items gonna be appending from top to bottom hierarchy okay so this is basically the manipulation of the data nothing else you can call the api with the page size okay so you can just uh, set the page number when you scroll down just uh, add the page page number over here then it show you the loading part over here this is that part okay so if fetch data is less than the page size there is no more data, more data to be load set has more to be false and simulate data with a one second delay. Okay, so it is item loaded. Fix the total number of items that is thousand we have added. Okay, next we in the infinite loader here we have so is items loaded. So first we check how many items is loaded. Items count and lo load more items. It has the items to load or not. So it is come with the fetch data part. Okay, so this is that one. okay infinite fetch data then we have a on items render a reference then we have a fixed size list for the react window and here we have done all the manipulation on items rendered items count okay and here the come with the loading one okay so div index style index if items index then index text else we are asking for add a text loading okay and loading has p loading and if has no more then we are showing that the no more items to load so this is the thing that we have added over here okay so you can see that one scroll loading 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 okay so this is how if you are able to handle the more data with the help of the loading text you can use the infinite loader with the react window okay so any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day.